Hello beautiful people, this is your girl Aqua Goddess coming to give you all a general energy reading. Keep in mind that this reading will be for past, present, future and it may or may not resonate with you. If you're interested in booking a personal reading with me, if you'd like to donate to my channel or purchase any manifestation jewelry, the information will be in the description box below. This reading will be recorded for January 22nd, 2023. And this will be for Scorpio Sagittarius Cusp. So if you are born between November 18th and November 24th, these messages may apply for you. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much for coming. If you are not new, welcome back. Thank you so much for the love and support. Please be sure to like and subscribe to our channel to help our family grow and also to receive your notifications for your future reads. I've already prayed and meditated over your energy, so we're just going to go ahead and tap right in. Spirit, angels, ancestors, guides, please protect me while channeling the messages for my Scorpio Sagittarius cusp. Please return all negative energy back to sender to million fold. And anybody out there showing me love, much love and light to you. Alright, so what are the messages, Spirit, for my Scorpio Sagittarius cusps? Someone is definitely looking you up. This may be someone that you haven't talked to in a while. They're wanting to figure out what you're doing and who you're doing it with. This is somebody who has a shitty personality. They took you through a lot of unnecessary bullshit. They miss you. This person regrets the actions that they've taken towards you and they want to fix things. I don't see that you're any longer interested in this person. They've done a lot of things to turn you off. Play with your emotions. For some of you all, you may have even had to involve the authorities or this person may be affiliated with jail or court or some type of legal issues. Yes, this is someone that you may have had a fight with or they're known for domestic violence or just getting out of character. This person feels like it's a misfortune um, that you guys had to experience this, but I feel strongly that they are the cause of all of this. This person's having a hard time just letting you live your life. They want to know what's going on with you. Yes, this person definitely feels like you have a double life. I would say that because you seem a lot happier without this person. You may be dressing or looking a different kind of way since you guys stopped talking. And this person is confused about that. They could definitely be stalking. Also, this is someone that could have had a whole nother personality, another life, another wife. Who even knows? They definitely have a double life or a part of them that you don't see. But it may have gotten exposed some kind of way. Angel number 405. Yes, I see that you no longer want to deal with this person at all. At some point, this may have been someone that you wanted to build a marriage with or just a solid firm connection. This person can have a, a very nice body. They can have tattoos. Um, they may come off as a boss in the beginning, but then you see that they have a lack of morals or a lack of prioritizing things. So it's like they put on this front, you know, like they have it all together, but really they don't. 
some of you guys could be dealing with some type of legal issues with your your manager you may have to report this person to human resources there could be some type of legal issues i don't know if this is whatever kind of harassment or whatever this is um i do see that there's some type of misfortune for this boss they could be getting fired or something of that sort yeah somebody wanted to take you through court or something and get some money from you or just take money from you some kind of way whether it be through your job firing you or like a lawsuit legal something like that that's very specific for somebody it's not going to work for this person whoever they are they will fail epically could be a baby mom or a baby dad could be having some co-parenting issues here and this person may be trying to get you fired or something so that they can report it in court when you guys go to court. They could be trying to get some money or something from you. Wow. So very soon you will be meeting someone. Um, you guys are going to be very fond of each other. You'll love to spend time with one another. You have a lot of fun and you can't keep your hands off of each other. You may have movie nights or just dates that go great. Um, I see this person is going to want to marry you. Um, they definitely want to make it more than just a fish you. They want to make this thing solid. This person's trying to build an empire with you. You guys will meet each other's friends and families and kind of just entangle. If you already have children and they have children, you guys will have a blended family. This person definitely does not want to run from their emotions. They know exactly how they feel about you. But they may be the more stay-at-home type. So they may not get out super much. They could go out on a movie night or a date night every now and then. But this person likes to spend time at home. Yeah, whoever this um, energy is, this baby mom or baby dad, this person was exposed for being somebody that they truly weren't and maybe using you for money or sex. Whatever the case may be, it was exposed. And I see that it's caused a misfortune in this connection. This could be someone that works in a club. It could be a DJ or a performer. Or you guys could just be spending time out with friends at the club. Or they could. What else for my Scorpio Sagittarius Cus spirit? What other messages? Good news. So you have some type of good news coming up, and I'm believing it's around a solid connection, um, a marriage, or a commitment. Um, definitely you guys could be studying some type of new skills as well. You may meet your future husband or future wife and doing that thing. Or this person could definitely invest in your dreams, your passions. Yes, I definitely see you could meet this person through work, whoever this new person is that you may marry. I see you mastering some type of skill, something that you're studying is going to bring you great fortune. You're working very hard and I see that you also have, um, you may be working alone right now, but you're going to meet somebody that's going to want to build with you. <clears throat>
This person is definitely going to want to take their time um, to make this offer to you because this is someone that wants marriage. They want forever. And so they want to make sure that they're making the right choice. But this person is going to know that they care about you very much. It could be an Aries, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. I'm definitely saying that this person is going to want to reveal a lot when it comes to you. This is somebody that's very creative. They're going to want to know, you know, what type of ideas you have and how they can help you build your business or help you with your journey. Yeah, this is someone that wants to grow with you. They see you as being the empress here and they want to have a ten of cups with you. This is somebody who has very direct communication. They know exactly what they want. They pay very close attention to detail. They're very strategic when they plan things. They set boundaries with people. They can be very cold if they're pushed. Yes, this person is going to want to have you by their side for forever. I see that some of you guys have lost someone that's crossed over. This person is saying that they carry your heart. They carry your heart and theirs. So if you lost a parent or a sister or a friend or grandmother or anybody here and somebody's reaching out to me they know you haven't forgotten about them they haven't forgotten about you they watch over you very closely they're saying that they carry your heart and theirs and they know that you carry their heart and yours wow moon child every saint has a past every sinner has a future wow that's powerful so never let a person judge you by your past things that you've learned from in your life have made you who you are today spirit says you are stronger than you think so the pain that you went through created a strength within you. This is why you are the Empress. You weren't just born. You know, you just weren't. <clears throat> you had to go through a lot. You had to overcome a lot. Some of you all may be new mothers. Are definitely birthing a lot of new ideas. Okay. You made up your mind about something creative that you're wanting to do. Some of you guys, you have family or friends that may have crossed over. And it's like, you do it for them, you do it for your children. You're self-motivated because you've been through a lot. So even if you feel like you don't have the support you need, you always seem to push through. You're a warrior. This is warrior empress, warrior god, warrior goddess energy. Inner harmony. Solar plexus, third chakra. I trust my wisdom and respond accordingly. I do not allow my mind to create doubt or to override my strong gut feelings. I accept and express my feelings while accepting the feelings of others. 
I am at peace with myself and those around me and I do not harbor unrealistic expectations of myself or of others. I release the need to control others. My personal power is free from ego and from any desire to manipulate or exploit situations or people. The foundation of all my thoughts and actions is trust in myself. Trust your intuition. Trust your gut feelings. You definitely have someone that's protecting over you as well as your spirit guides, your ancestors, the most high, whomever you praise. You're very highly favored. You have a strong intuition. Never doubt it. You are growing very fast. You will take a lot of risk. Some won't go as planned, but most will be successful. <laughs> you are stronger than you ever know. A lot of you guys are about to find out just how strong you actually are. You will be successful and you will influence a lot of lives. You will help a lot of people. Whomever this is that you lost in the physical, I see that you will honor their name very proudly. This person loves you. Wow. Those are the messages. Wow. This was a beautiful reading, my loves. If you enjoy this reading, or if you resonate with this reading, please make sure you like and subscribe, and I will talk to you soon. Peace.